Hello everyone, and welcome back to Let's Play Baldur's Gate, The Siege of Dragonspear, where we are here once again in this tomb underneath the mine that the dwarves uh, dug, and we're trying to explore it a bit, and uh, it's been a little tough. We've had to uh, really make use of Baloth and his magic. Without him, I don't think we'd be able to do this place at all. But uh, we just killed a bronze uh, sentry. Quiet is appealing at times. This is not one of those times. Let us move on. We're getting really close. 13,000 to leveling up. That's actually really exciting. 21,000. 19,000. She's getting close too. That's great. 44, 94, 44. I'm really excited to get leveled up again. Oh, boy. What is it now? In Cactus... I? Yes? I'm looking forward to this. Oh, wow, I missed. Go ahead. Your yen? What? This isn't working. We have to try something else. Working. I'm listening. What is that? Why isn't it working? It's a shadow. Okay. You need the white a bit with that. Do another one right there. Hopefully that's far enough away. This isn't working. We have to try something else. Time to go? Yep. Time to go. Yes? Uh-huh. You Time to end. This isn't working. We have to try something else. Well, then try something else. Stop saying it and try it. Yes. There you go. Hey. What? Okay. No sooner said than done. Save it. Let's move in. Chest key. Cleric's vestments. These dark red and green robes are a simple, simple dwarven design, but made with material of the highest quality and care. The sleeves and fringes fringe end in gold trim, and the lining is soft and luxurious. Silk, as is traditional for dwarven noble wear. This is the one dude, right? More than likely. Um, okay. Let's organize this a bit. We need to get you more potions. Don't we have more in here? We have one. Okay. What is wrong with you? Ability score drained. That's not good. Make it quick. Um, you go ahead and collect all the arrows. Yes, of course. Back up. I'm here, and I Okay. Hear. Cast web right here. Good. Fireball right there. Back up. Task. What? I'll you attack him. Hmm? Switch to this. Attack. Ask someone else. Probably back there. To you all. Don't like that you're up there. To task. What? Do this. God damn it, I'm gonna die. Or no, that's Safana. She's gonna die. Oh, because you guys can't kill a freaking bone bat quicker than that. The darkness claims another. 
That's sad. Go ahead. I. Make it quick. A waste of my talents. It can't do so. Fuck me, shadow. Your yen. Kill him. Good. Took damage there. Me. Yes. See ya. Might as well do another one. What the hell is that thing? Hey, Axe, get out of there. Kill that guy. He scares me. Make it quick. Timed. My insides are becoming. You called? You bet. Okay. Yes. No sooner said than done. Yes. Need someone to pick up all of her stuff. This is her, right? I understand. Yep. What? We'll have to revive her when we get back to camp. Talents. Or maybe just take someone else. <laughs> okay. There is a throne here. The elaborate metal throne remains an impressive sight, despite the state of Dish's pair it's been left in after years of neglect. Okay. What do we have here? Push to a corner of the table. A lumping golden box sits collecting dust among something. Failed phylactery. I knew I knew the liches were happening. Several sheets of parchment are covered in notations written by a steady meth method methodical hand. Much of the writing is faded beyond legibility, or consists of arcane equations beyond your understanding. A few lines near the bottom of the pile, however, can be deciphered. Though the, go though the gold alloy proved more difficult to work than anticipated, I remain convinced that once it has, or once it is rendered sufficiently malleable, it will be an ideal substance from which to construct a phylactery. The heat of the elemental plane of fire should render the material more pliant. I will use the portal to access the Searing Inferno shortly. First, I must cry a suitably private location there in which to do my work. Hmm. Okay. Make it quick. How rude. How rude. There's going to be more fighting over here, isn't there? Clint, we should probably heal you, huh? What? We are a man down, but, you know, it is what it is. I hate this game. <laughs> With flare. Oh, my God. How long is this going to take? Well, I guess we'll lead him to the fountain. Hopefully that'll be enough time for him to stop doing that. Okay. Now there's another chamber over here, it looks like. The laboratory. So, was the, um, the guy that they were hunting for, is he, was he trying to make himself a lich? I mean, all of this stuff is older than him, but maybe he found some sort of journal about it. 
and wanted to come here to do that? Hmm. I'm not sure. There we go. Welcome back to the land of the living, Heliax. Oh, can we take that? Your inventory's full. Of course. It's full? What? From what? Oh. Okay. God damn it. <laughs> Not sure if that matters, but we took it. Has there been a chest that we couldn't unlock anywhere? There was one upstairs, wasn't there? Last slot on the pedestal. 3,000 experience. Through the air, though the air remains still and stagnant in the chamber, the pool atop the pedestal ripples and begins to swirl. You find yourself thinking of the people who have affected you most of late. Of one especially. Immowen. Kaler Argent. The Hooded Man. Hmm. You might as well think of the people who have affected you most of late. See, if it was just like the affected... If it wasn't the of late thing, it would be Immowen. But she's been, you know, in his life for as long as he can remember. Okay, they're Argent, however. Definitely somebody more recent. As you think of her, the pool grows calm. An indistinct image appears within it, quickly growing in clarity. You find yourself watching a scene unfold from above, as a god might do. You know my name. You know my cause. But you do not know my story. Mine is a noble family, blessed in every way. The Argents are destined for greatness, or so some think. I thought it myself once. Thinking I could do no wrong, I wronged many, far too many. In time, I came to realize that my actions were not without consequence, that a price was paid, though it was not paid by me. I knew that had to change, but how? How might I redeem myself for my sins? For years, I prayed for guidance, and then one day, one glorious day, an answer was bestowed on me by the gods themselves. Many have been taken from this world before their time, lost in the Dragon Spear Wars, dragged down into the Nine Hells in defiance of the Holy Order of Things. Some believe they are gone, never to return. I know better. With you at my back, I swear to you, what was lost will be restored. Hmm. A whole bunch of XP. Very nice. A remote view on Kaylor Archie. Can I do more? As you pour the vials clear fluid into the pool, the murky water clears somewhat. Oh, that's what the vials of purity are. Immowen. As you think of her, the pool grows calm. An indistinct image appears within it, quickly growing in clarity. You find yourself watching a scene unfold from above as a god might do. Concentrate, girl. Clear your mind of all thoughts. That should be easy. A lot of people say there isn't much thinking going on in there to begin with. You are not without wit, Imowen, but that will only take you so far. What you need and currently lack is focus. Forgive me, Duke Janath. It's just... It's hard. My best friend is charging into a dragon's mouth, and I'm just sitting here, thinking about magic and stuff. If you were truly thinking about magic, you'd not be talking so much. <laughs> I made a mistake. I should never have let them go face Kalar without me. In your current state, you'd be nothing but a burden. If you truly want to help your friend, you must focus your mind and your energies on your studies. You're right. I know you're right. All right. What am I supposed to do again? Clear your mind. Clear my mind. Right. I could do that. Clearing my mind. Clearing my mind. Mind being cleared. Clear mind. Cleared mind. Clear mind. Ah. <laughs> oh, that doesn't look like it went well. Witness the vision in the pool. As you pour the vials of clear fluid into the pool, uh, it becomes clear. The hooded man. 
Think of the pool grows calm, as God might do. Let's see what this guy's all about. You came. Good. I wasn't sure you would. Hmm. I was curious. I had to learn who would be so arrogant, so foolish as to summon me in such a fashion. Who are you who thinks himself my equal, my better even, judging by your messages tone? Me? I am not but a servant. If you know who I am, you know that I do not deal with the servants of others. If your master would speak with me, I am happy to do so. Or has he grown so weak, even his words can no longer reach this plane? Do not doubt my master's power, or our allies. You think I doubt the Umbral Accord's power? If you respected it, you would not do as you did in Baldur's Gate. The child of Baal belongs to my master. I've done nothing to keep the godling from you. You are trying to influence Baal's spawn, and in doing so, you interfere with my master's business. The Accord will not let this continue. Perhaps you are right. Perhaps not. You do not speak for the Accord. And I do not bow to the demands of some broken fiend's lickspittle. Damn. Some harsh words there. Alright. You stare into the gray murky water of the pool, finding nothing but your own reflection within it. Make it quick. A waste of my talent. All right. So, let's go over here. One more place to look into. Save it. Good our XP. It's so close. Yes. And hide in the shadows. Of course. Okay, there's actually a lot more left to do. Drowned in blood, uninjured. Oh boy. Okay. What is it now? You're out of fireballs, aren't you? Okay. Do we have more spider webs? Yes. Can I do that? What? You switch to your bow. I understand. Fire. Time to end you. I can you hit him from here? Oh shit, what? they're they're doing something. Your yen? So you say. Make it quick. Switch to your bow too. Fire. See ya. Fistfuls of flaming finality. Good. Yes. Hit this one now. Ask someone else. That's missile. I'll recover. That actually works out well. Speak. Okay, this guy's kind of hard to hit, I guess. What is it now? Magic missile. Good. Nope. Time to go Back. You bet. Yes, and Back. fair enough. All of you. Under him. I Uh oh. Your yen. I know you were back here. Make it quick. I'm a recover. Ow. Uh huh. Life is mine. This isn't working. We have to try something else. See. So you say. Back off, back this off. isn't working. Go ahead. You after him. Yes. Switch. Get in there. Ask someone else. Magic missile him. Good. He's dead. All of you, onto him. Magic missile him. 
There's another one. Back out. Heal. True. I am yours, fair enough. Attack. Yes, a waste of my talents. Get in there. I'm listening. Switch weapons, attack. You call? Um hear yourself again. What is it now? Over here, magic missile. Death to you all. One more. We got the rest up to this, aren't we? Good. To task. What? A waste of my talents. Okay, good. The hell is this place? Big pool of blood. Okay. Looks like there's one more room left to go into. I'm a little weary about going in there right now. Maybe we should rest. Let's save it. And rest. We're spending like a week in this this zone. God damn it. We don't have like the magic to just like kill them either. Alright. Make it quick. Switch. Yes? Switch. Attack. Yes? Attack. Your yen. Hit that one. Fight if you must, but you're not winning this. What? A waste of my talents. Make it quick. Good. That worked out well. Save it. Sleep. Good. All right. Yes. No sooner said than done. I'm gonna throw these in here. All right. What do we have in here? I don't understand how a powerful woman can submit so easily to male influence. Next time you open your mouth, close it quickly before that sort of idiocy spills off your tongue. Yeah, sorry, Corvin. You're not gonna like most of the people I, <laughs> I bring along with me. A waste of my talents. Make yeah, it it's supposedly locked. A waste of my talents. So it has no visible lock. Yes. The pillars. No said than done. Oh boy. What? No sooner said than done. Alright, let's see what we got going on here. There's a brass plate set into the stone pillar. Etched upon it is the image of a cracked and fragmented leaf. Okay. <laughs> Don't know what I'm supposed to do with that. Adorning the stone pillar is the image of a leaf etched upon a brass plate. A brass plate etched with a snowflake design is set into the stone pillar. And etched upon a brass plate set in the stone pillar is an abstract design that calls to the mind of the image of the shimmering sun. Make it quick. A waste of my Okay, talent. that doesn't help me at all, if I'm being honest. Is this thing open yet? It said to the northwest. Is there something I missed? Sickly colored smoke rises and capers behind this strange container's dust covered glass. Yes, a waste of my talents. Yeah, it's an opening what? mechanism northwest of your current location. A waste northwest. Of my talents. Of my current location. Something on the wall that I missed? Let's 
It's not this thing, the scrying pool. Is there something in here? The wall of this ancient library has collapsed inward, spilling countless volumes of arcana lore across the ground. Huh, I don't see anything. Sort of mechanism. I mean, over here it's starting to get to be more west than northwest, huh? Must be in the laboratory? I don't see anything in here. Hmm. Guess we haven't completely fully explored the laboratory, maybe. It's not over here. Some mangled creatures float inside these glass tubes. All oh, are dead. I'm supposed to sit in the throne. <laughs> I don't know. Seems like a bad idea. Concealed in the chair's left arm is an intricately carved wooden lever. The mechanism is connected to its. Uh, it is too old. Two is old but well made. It's likely still in function. All right. You pull the lever in the chair's arm, and hear sound the sound of ancient gears grinding together. Traces of dust fall from the ceiling as the groan of moving metal echoes throughout the complex. A blue mist rises from the depths of the earth, bringing with it the stench of magic and decay. Gazing into the mists makes your head throb, but the sensation passes once you look away. Okay. Staring at the smoke within these containers, you catch fleeting glimpses of faces, people, events longer past yet, yet to occur. So you imagine. Okay. Liquid that once filled the complex network of tubes and vials set upon this table it was dried, but the odor of feet and lunacy still linger in the air around it. Did I get everything from here? Yeah, it's just scrolls. Okay. Let's see. Okay. So this door should be open now. Which we know we have skeletal archers in there, so we need to be mindful of that. Back up. See ya. All right, we're just gonna fire right in there. Make it quick. No sooner said than done. I don't know if there are more than two. There was. You stand no chance. Ask someone else. Magic Muslim. Guess he's almost dead. Your orders? Arrows aren't gonna be effective here, guys. Good. What? Kill the last one. Oh my god, this is a lot more to this room than I thought. Okay. Make it quick. No sooner said oh, no, that's done. not that big of a room. What are, what are these things? Remains. I only buy tattered remnant cloths. Okay. Kind of creepy. All right, mm -hmm. come in here and get all the arrows. I can't carry that too. I dropped it. You did what? You don't drop anything. You understand me? I guess you are carrying a lot of... Oh, carrying Safana's stuff. Well, 
one is away. Yeah, you still okay on arrows. Yes. Okay, do we need the remains? No sooner said than done. Who are these the remains of? A cavity around the building's entrance has been dug into the dirt and rock piled over it, but there is little hope of escaping the site from here. Okay. So... What is the point of this place? Hmm. I guess we'll pick up the remains. How, 20 pounds? And whose robes are those? Hmm. What? No sooner said than done. Make it quick. Of course. Glint is encumbered Whee! by how much? I thought you could carry more than that. You're weak. Oh, she's not gonna be able to carry that. Helix. And then I guess we'll have to give one to Bailoth. Bailoth, he can carry this. I'm gonna put this on. I think it's time to make a yes. trip upstairs. Of my talents. I don't know how to get in this last room. We might have to look it up. Like, I have no clues. Gold leaf and stuff. And unless there's something to do over here now that we've got the phylactery. I think we found the guy's robes, so we're going to go to the uh, dwarves to see if we can get rid of it. No sooner said than done. I also think it was this chest way up here that I couldn't open. I wonder if that opens now. Hey, Deep Vein. How are we doing, XP? Closer. Closer every day. You've returned. What did you find? Any sign of Gerlin Coldheart? What? Okay, no I guess they're not his that. robes. Interesting. You guys don't want these remains either? There's no reason for me to have them. Alright. Make it quick. So back here. Of course. It's this one that's locked, right? All that remains of the wax seal that once contained this ancient parchment secrets is a gray stain on its back. On the other side is a letter written centuries ago. It's simple but effective part per penmanship, making the message easy to read despite its age. Dearest Carella, our journey to the Shadow King's outpost has been long and treacherous. Trolls, hobgoblins, gnolls, zvarts, and even a gargoyle stood twixt us and our goal but we have finally made it across Coastway Crossing. If the map purloined from the Netherese's vampire steers us true, we cannot be far from our goal. Even if this venture proves as profitable as Watkins believes it will be, I believe that when I see it, and perhaps not even then, there are many more dangers ahead. No property of the Shadow King will be left undefended. At a, minim at a minimum, we are told to expect resistance from a small army of minor undead, which do not concern me over much, and a lich under the influence of the king's overmind, which concerns me greatly. Once these threats are dealt with, the going should be much become much easier. Along with the map, the vampire supplied us with a key. It claimed opens the door to the Shadow King's inner sanctum. It spoke of a treasure room hidden within, loaded with items of great power and value. I send this letter to you in the hopes that it finds you in good health, and that we will be together again soon. But however soon that may be, it cannot be enough for my taste. Until then, I remain yours, Agda Coldhearth. Interesting. If we're to wait here, I might begin a brand new business. In the Journal of Gern Coldhearth, an inscription on the inside cover of this small leather journal identifies its owner as one Gern Coldhearth. The lettering beneath the name is only legible after several seconds of study. And by the same hand as Coldheart's name, it read, Devoted of uh, Dumathoin, before it was violently the crossed out, tearing the paper in several places. Guys, yeah, shut up. Gurn Coldheart. That's right, I got. 
Hold on, let me uh, pause it. Out of the way, they won't talk. <laughs> Gern Coldhearth valued his secrets. The bulk of the journal's entries written in a complex code beyond your ability to decipher. The latest entry, however, was scrawled quickly across the page in the common language of the realms. Must record this quickly before the memory fades. Last night as I slept, the mind of the Shadow King's Lich touched mine. It confirmed that we will soon reach the outpost if we continue to dig. When we do, I will go to him and perform a ritual severing him from the overmind. In exchange, he shall grant me what I seek. No longer need I live in fear of the sickness ravaging my bo this body. I must push Deep Vein and the others all the harder to continue digging until at last what I so richly deserve is finally mine. Ah, that's not good. Yes? What? A waste of my That's talents. not good at all. Maybe they want to hear this one? I found his journal, guys. It's not good. Hmm. Still no clues as to how to get into the chamber. You've returned. What did you find? I found this journal. Any sign of Gern Coldhearth? Gern Coldhearth is not a, is not the man you thought he was. What are you talking about? You were empty-headed no you you wee empty-headed nonsense. <laughs> Gern manipulated you, tricked you into traveling here that he might enrich himself. You think you serve your god? Fool. You serve no one but Gern Coldhearth. He used you. I'll go with number one. Gern Coldhearth was a good man. One of the best. I'm not having you talk about him this way. Read this journal yourself. You'll see I speak the truth. Oh no, 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 no. This cannot be. Coldhearth, you ill-spawned bastard. How could you do this to me? He is a disciple of Abathor. You and your fellows were a sacrifice made... In the name of greed. I'll ask him when I see him. I'm not strong enough to face him as a mortal. Never in mind as an undead. You though. You might be able to take him. Especially with this. We call it the secret revealed. Its light blinds and burns all creatures on uh, life. It may help you defeat the lich. But use it sparingly. It will not last long. If it fails ye, bring it back. I may be able to take to make it work again once or twice before the secret's power is lost. Huh. Now go find Cold Arth and lay the traitor low before he gets what he seeks. Interesting. The secret revealed. This green gemstone glows with the power of Dumathoin, the keeper of secrets beneath the mountain. Its divine power exacts a heavy price on the undead, especially liches. Interesting. It's got three charges. Okay. Can I wear these? What do they look like? Oh, they're ugly. <laughs> uh, here. Oh, you're too far away. Maybe Should we go back and get no Seraphin back? Probably, huh? Uh, yeah, we need to go back, get, get Seraphin. Trying to think if we want to take somebody else with us instead. We could drop Seraphin and get Minsk and Dinah here back. I don't know if that would be better. Probably. I mean, she's talents. not great, is she? We could take Edwin with us. That might not be a bad idea. Get rid of her and take it, taking Edwin instead. Just have more magic. We might do that. Hmm? What? Have at them. Attack. What? Oh, a bunch of wolves. Yes. Well, should not be a problem for us anymore. My aim is true. Death delivered. Name. It'd be embarrassing if we died the wolves at this stage. We will take the XP though. How long you last against me? No sooner said than done. This uh, this dungeon here is proving a lot more difficult than I would have imagined it being. <laughs> 
<laughs> like, you think even if we had Kagane, it'd be... I don't know, Kagane would have made things a lot easier. Just having somebody who can group everybody up and not die would be very nice. Okay, so first things first, we need to revive Seraphin, because we don't want her dead. We like Seraphin. I think you're the, uh... Cleric here? Yeah, here we go. There you go. And we can pass over... All your stuff here. I do think she's cool with the dagger and the, uh... Wakazashi. But she just doesn't really help out the, the group enough. I can barely manage doing backstabs with, uh, with just Heliax, let alone her, too. What? All right, Edwin. A waste of my talents. I think he'll be more useful. What? What is it you want now? It had best be worth my time, or there will be hells to pay. I speak with you, Master Odysseian, is it not? I give you a man of your gifts at my side. Join me. And why would I do that? Where's the benefit in this for me? Um. The benefit lies in keeping Kayla's hands from your throat now and ne for now and ever. Are you trying to vex me? If so, you will have to try harder than that. But not much harder. Keep pushing. What? What is it you want uh, now? I'll make it worth your while, drumming. Very well. Okay. I shall accompany <laughs> there you. There you go. For now, Move him. at least. Or her, rather. There we go. Make it of course. So now for you. you. Yes. Again. Oh. Did I never level you up? Oh no, I guess you get more levels though. Here you go. Level 3, level 4, level 5. More hit points too. Up to level 9. Okay, yeah, so he did need to level up. Great. Now you don't have any equipment, right? Not like any like amazing equipment anyway. Okay, cool. So magic wise. Let's see, you got grease, which could come in handy. Armor will be fine. Over here you got horror. Mirror image. Powered sleep. Hmm. I don't think that's gonna be very good right now. I don't think horror is going to be good either. I don't think any of these are going to be great. Let's get a bunch of acid arrows. Level 4. Fireball, flame arrow, fireball. Monster summoning. Let's get another fireball in there. For f level 4 spells. We got monster summoning. Stone skin. Minor globe of inner invulnerability. What does this do? Uh, measures here around the caster that prevents any first, second, or third level spells effects from penetrating. Hmm. It could be useful. Let's do another monster summoning for that. And then, ooh, what does Breach do? Whoops. What about cast on at a creature? It breaches and dispels all of the specific in combat uh, and combat protections on the target creature. Uh, so it gets rid of shield protection, a whole bunch of stuff. I mean, we'll take one of those and then two monster summoning threes. That'd be good. All right. You want me to what? Uh, I want you to stay here for a while. You'd ha leave me behind? Am I so very dull that you feel you must be rid of me? Very well, I will do as you wish. And yeah, don't yes. guilt me. You're just not useful. <laughs> you do everything I can do. I need a of some strong dwarven ale. Another rest. Then we gotta find a way to get into Inner Sanctum. Gold Leaf. I don't. Don't know what that's about. Hmm. I do kind of hope that it's not related to, um. Um. Whatchamacallit? Those statues way up there, because I'm not. <laughs> That's the only other thing I'm thinking about. Like, what else could I be missing? Hmm. We don't have that grave anywhere, do we? Still haven't seen that.
Hmm. Yeah, the stone statues. Uh, they might be something. I don't know. We have gnomes in the Underdark as well, you know. Sverf Neblin? I wouldn't call them gnomes exactly. Uh, not gnome gnomes. They're a dour a waste lot, of aren't my they? Talents. Dusty and grim. Dusty and grim. Okay, so... How do we use that pillar? Did I... Hmm. I don't know. I don't know what to do. I do think this group is probably much more... We'll get more use out of Edwin than maybe with Safana anyway. No sooner said than done. The only thing I can think of is we use the the fire portal to melt this thing down into specific shapes. Might be kind of annoying to have to go back and forth though, huh? Take a look over here one more time. This thing's not anything, is it? Well, go over to it then, man. No sooner said than done. Why did that happen? What is it? Yes, yes, I see. So you say. Uh huh. Go ahead. Well, bowl. Make it quick. Ha! My aim is true. How? What is it now? I'm listening. Yes. You have a lot less spells. I'm looking forward to this. Did you oh both attack God. the same one? God damn it. I? Yes. Hmm? You're I'm busy right now. Yes. Ow! Ow! I don't like that. Hmm. See ya. What? Right, everybody on this guy. There we go. Make it quick. A waste of my talent. Okay. I'm not sure what that was about, but is that what we're supposed to do? The grinding gears within the pillars tell you the mechanism they contain have been reset. Is that what the other one said? Can I see it still? Okay. So I have to have the right order. Good to know. Ask someone else. What? Okay. Let's save it. Yes. I wish I remembered what they did, but let's. I guess we'll just go click this one now. Talents. Okay, so that's the first good one. I wish I remembered what they did. I guess we'll just guess. What? A waste. Oh god, they're immune. I'm gonna reload. I don't feel like doing that part. Uh, I guess I shouldn't. I'm gonna do it anyway, though. You can't stop me.
Ah, that's bad. Bad taste to do that, but... I really don't want to be doing these all over again and again and again. Maybe this one? Wait, what? Wait, did that open the door? Is that the only one I needed to press? No. I'm confused. Why did that one tell me? Hold on. Am I just pressing the wrong thing? What? Of course. If I. No. I'm confused. <laughs> Okay. I'm gonna assume it's this one. Okay. We got it. I don't really understand, but I got it. Okay. Now for the hard part. No sooner said than done. Save it. You think there's going to be talking involved? Should we just walk in and see what we have first? We don't want to waste spells, so. Alright, a bone bat. Okay. I? You're going to do a web right here. You. While you do again. a fireball right here. Okay. Your yen. Now you're both gonna summon spider spawn. What is it now? Monster three. You're, you're going to start firing. See And we'll just let this do its work for now. As we wait to see what else we have going on in here. Oh, that was my header cap. Took some damage. Bone bat died. Shadowed soul. Your orders. Start firing at this guy. Mm. It's getting misty in here now. All right. Looks like the um, web is down. Else. Do another web, but we're gonna try and put it further in. Ha! My aim is true. Hmm? Right, this one. Yes. Oh, what are you doing? Get in there. It's time to start doing some fireballs in there. Good. What? Hit this guy. Another one's coming in. Okay. What is it now? now that that's been done. Hit it with a fireball. Hmm? Throw your fireball in there too. Okay, what else have we got? 
There should have been a shadowed, shadowed soul somewhere in here, right? That went pretty well, though. That seems to like to be a really strong strategy right there. Just web them and then start bombarding them with fireballs and arrows. I like it. I like it a lot. Now, obviously, it's very spell intensive. So, you know, you yes. have to rest more often, but... A waste of my talents. Save it. Oh, look at our XP. Look at it. All right, pool of blood. Gotta love it. Another door. God damn it. Okay. Hmm. It is over, Cold Hearth. You have survived the transformation. Keep your phylactery secure and your unlife will be long. Long and prosperous. Abathor be praised. You freed me from the overmind and in turn, I gave you what you desired. Our business is done. Beware my former master. Should he learn of your existence, he will take you as he did me. Aye, aye, I know. The Shadow King won't hear a peep from me. Fare thee well, Kodorth. We shall not meet again. I should return to the drawers and tell them what, ha what I know about Kodorth. And that let's kill him first. Okay. So far, he's not no sooner said than attackable. Uh, who are you now? How did you come to this place? It's a long story. A story that ends in a pitched battle with a dwarven lich. I came here seeking power and wealth, the same as you. This is a happy coincidence. You seek power and wealth, and I happen to have both in spare. But I'll not just hand them over to you. Oh no. First, you must prove yourself worthy of Abathor's bounty. I assume you came to this place as I did. Through the tunnel just dug by Deep Vein and Dum Dumathoin. Dumathoin's other faithful. Whether they li yet live or were slain by the outpost's defenses, I know not. Hmm. I'm not going to tell them they're alive. I'll just say I came through there. The disciples of the S sacred gleam carried with them a relic in five parts. The amulets of the five keeper. The amulets of the keeper of secrets under the mountain. I am kind to those who do me a kindness. Generous to those who serve my needs. Bring the five keepers' amulets to me, and I shall bestow upon you an item of great power. What say you? Hmm. Amulets, you say? I believe I have them already. You, you see? An intriguing proposition. Give me some time to consider it. Yeah, all right. But for all that, for all the effort, it better be an item of great power. I'll not waste my time on items of moderate f <laughs> to fair power. Shall be done. I'll crawl through a pit of maggots before di doing your bidding. Fiend, die. Huh. I'm curious to see what item he has. Alex is intrigued by the offer of power. He doesn't really like being called a servant. Or serving his needs, but... I have it already, you see? Let me have those. Yes, yes, they're perfect. They're... No. What treachery is this? Hmm? I said I needed all five amulets, and this is what you give me? You try to cheat Cold Hearth. Abathor's hands on on Toro. You will pay for this mortal this mortal. Pay for it with your life. Ah. Huh. I didn't I didn't know I was trying to cheat you. <laughs> it's my bad. I Okay. You're gonna try and hold person. What? While you do this. You're going yes, to charge in. You're going to yes, charge in. You're going Go to ahead. shoot him. Make it quick. And you're gonna use this on him. Mm -hmm. 
Your yen. All right, magic missile. Again. Magic missile. Yes. Get in there. Curses. Oh, that's, that's not good. I am yours to Turn undead. Yes, Turn undead. CEO? Magic missile. You. Again. Break. Stop him. Ha! My aim is true. Wait, I didn't get any experience for killing him. Oh, we gotta kill his phylactery. A waste of my talent. That's right. Okay. Hmm? Oh, I'm out of space. Uh da, 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 da. Yeah, you can hold on to some stuff now that you're here. Um What was that that I just picked up? Ancient key. Make it quick. Of course. Has to be in here. How long does it take? Usually it takes them a while. Like, lore-wise, it's supposed to take them a while to recover from being killed, right? There's going to be traps in here, aren't there? Like, we can almost guarantee there's going to be traps in here. Oh God! You're too far away to examine that. Yes, a waste of my talents. An intricate carving of a rose with a long thorny stem wraps around the surface of the lacquered burgundy box. The careful craft, caref carefully crafted piece seems heavier than it than it ought. Okay. A small fortune of precious stones is set in a large fortune of gold and silver formed into the shape of a box wrapped around the box is a large cord of supple material made of hide of some exotic beast. Okay, that's my guess as to the one that's him because he's all about greed, right? This modest, unadorned wooden box is tied shut with a string of leather. The other option is he went the complete opposite, right? A medallion in the shape of an elven skull hangs from a golden chain. Small green gems glittering in its eye sockets. The skull is apparently hollow. Shaking its shaking, it produces a barely audible rustling from within. At first glance, this brass amulet appears to be wrapped in chains of the same material. Closer inspection reveals that the chains are molded along the surface of the charm. The world, the word phylactery has been crudely carved upon the surface of this rough hewn stone cube. When you pick it up, something rattles within, but there's no obvious way to access the contents of the short short of shattering the box. My guess is it's this one. They're seemingly composed of malleable precious gems. The phyl this phylactery resists all attempts to damage it. Destroying it may require the power beyond the prime material plane. Okay. What? So no, for so that, we done. need to go to... Is he back? He's back. Okay. What is it now? Cast break. Make it quick. Cast this on him. I'm here, and I hear. This isn't working. We have to try something else. Yes. Yes. Cast this on him. Good. What? Of course. So far, so good. Let's get out of here, quick. So we gotta go to the fire plane. Looking into this pool of blood, you ga your gaze 
finds that of a sinister figure. After a brief moment, you realize you are staring at yourself, reflected upon the pool's glistening surface. They recognize the reflection for what it is. It still, it seems unfamiliar and alien, a stranger with your face. Scary. Okay. So far, he hasn't done a lot of damage to us, but I'm still worried. Like, liches are no joke. Corvin, you're going too quickly. Luckily, we explored the whole place before we, um, you know, got too far. Now we gotta kill these guys. Let's save it. Hopefully, it's not the salamanders. Hmm. Let me entertain you. It's not exactly what I what? wanted to, to see in what? here, but. Holy crap, that's a lot of damage. What do you need? Why do I not have any healing for you? Like, why am I stupid? Here. I'm giving out all this time. Time to go? Good. I'm huge in the underdark. Corbin. I'm listening. To battle! Make it no sooner said than done. Who's that? Oh god, he's back. Yes. My insides are becoming my outsides. So tired huh? of Zap. Kapow. Pew 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 Hit him. pew. Now there's Malcanter. Hit him. Never heard of him. What? Use this. No sooner said than done. How do I use this? Yes. I'll recover. Hey. I'll recover. Who's dying? Me, Make I'm dying. Quick. Yes. What? You cast the golden box down into the flames as it falls, the, melt, uh, the metal turns molten, its surface bubbling and sloughing off, the soul within screams in rage and fear. Beautiful. 22,000 experience there. Let's get out of here before no it summons something else. Done. All of you, come yes, on. No sooner said than done. That was great, and I do see we've leveled up. What is done is done. That was good. I enjoyed that. Let's go in here. Ready to level up. That's what I'd like to see. 25 more points here. We're level 11. It's awesome. Uh, let's get the five here. I'm done with that. <laughs> we can bump this up. Let's put this up to 90. And then I would like to get this up a little more too. Beautiful. Oh my god. Look at how much experience it takes to get to the next one. Holy crap. It's, I don't know if that's happening. Great. Uh, next one to level up is going to be her. 5,000 away. What? All right. Well, that's that for that. That That's that for that. Uh, that was a really fun quest. Really difficult. I like the challenge. Having Edwin with us really made it a lot easier, though. Having Edwin and Bailoth flinging fireballs and summoning creatures and stuff. Yeah, it's definitely the way to go. Now that we don't have a tank. All right, let's go tell the dwarf what happened. Talents. Now, there is a lich that has escaped. 
probably almost most definitely even more powerful lich than the one cold hearth was seeing as cold hearth was a new newly formed lich that must suck right <laughs> you go through all that trouble to become a lich and like minutes after you become one you die somebody comes in and kills your phylactery that sucks your return is cold hearth dead Tell me you ripped the catchpenny bastard's head from his shoulders. Code Hearth is no more. Wouldn't want to do that. Last time I tried to rip a dwarf's head off, I threw my back out. Okay, another joke. I secret re I, the secret revealed has lost its power. Can you make it work again? Mind your tone, Deep Vine or Deep Vein. Yeah, he's dead. He turned his he turned his back on me uh, on Great D Dumathoin. There's a price to be paid for that. You've done me a good turn, and no mistake, Teliax. Here, take these, please, for myself. I'll stay here, cleanse this place of unholy elements within it, and then... I cannot say what happens then. We gained a helmet. And we dropped it on the ground. <laughs> and create a restoration, and dropped it on the ground. Uh, we could use good men on our side when we face the crusade at Dragonspear. If you've some frustrations to work out, I know someone worthy of animosity, the Shining Lady. Yeah, join us. You make some sense. Alright then. When I'm done here, I'll make my way to Dragon Spear. Until then, keep your axe high, my friend. Cool. Um, so we got that. I can put this stuff in here. Pick this stuff up. You can identify this, and might as well identify this too while you're at it. This thing looks cool. A glittering green jewel adorns this battle helm, battle battered metal, blah, 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 battered metal helm infused with the power of dwarven the dwarven god Dumathoin. Physical damage resistance plus three percent. Constitution plus two for dwarves and plus one for others. Protects against critical hits. That sounds fantastic. Are you the only one that can wear helmets? Wait, you can't wear this. Oh, you can wear it. I mean, it's kind of saying you can't. Okay. Well, you definitely should be the one wearing it since you are going to be a tank. Make it quick. A waste of my talents. Awesome. Hey, hi, Hammer. I need a swig of some strong dwarven ale. Yeah, take heart. Yeah, yeah. Yes, no sooner said than done. Okay, that's it for that one. Got a cool helmet out of it too. And a whole bunch of XP. 22,000. That's a crazy amount. That was great. All right, we're going to go back to back to camp, not town. Back to camp, rest and that's where we'll end this episode. And next one we'll be ready to march on to Dragon Spear probably. Can't believe it. we've been like 10 hours in this expansion. We haven't even gotten to Dragon Spear yet. Been good though. That was really fun. Really uh tested my my strategies. I had to think of new things. I like I really like the idea of like webbing them, fireballing, throwing arrows in on them and all that stuff. That's really fun. Oh god damn it. Death to you all. You called? I don't want you to die, so drink a potion. Curses. Went down. There we go. A waste of my talents. All right. Hello. We would like to sleep. I need a swig of some strong dwarven ale. Nice good rest here. And we're done. Can I get yes, you lesser you restoration bet. real quick? But this is where we're going to end this episode, guys. Thank you for joining me on this on this quest here. Lesser restoration for you. There you go. Tomorrow we will be marching on towards Dragon Spear. Until then, I hope you all have a wonderful day. And I will catch you later.